All right, we're in Old Blue here. Let's so you know what time it is. I think it's only been a couple weeks. It wasn't that long ago I started. Three weeks ago, maybe? Eh, might have been a month ago. But I think it was a hard as fuck start because that had just come off a cold snap. Yeah, it had to be easily a month ago then. Anyway, it's a uh, fairly nice day, fairly warm. We'll see what we'll see what this fucker does. I don't have a camera down at the uh, down at the vacuum gauge this time, but. as hard as last time. Needle steady and uh, vacuum rising, which is good. That's solid. Yeah, because I don't know uh, if you saw the last one, it was a whole lot of crank. And uh, then it struggled to want to, uh, to want to keep it up, but uh, nice and steady right now gonna have to actually let this warm up good and proper because um, it hasn't moved in a while and I would imagine it'll stall right the fuck out if I uh... yeah if I go too early I'll be back I know I say this every time but this poor old girl just doesn't get enough love you know oh yeah fuck dude 22 inches of mercury son righteous as I was saying last time uh, even while I was struggling hard to get the fucker to start I really like this engine it's strong and uh, cranks over quickly which I don't get on the red one I think the red one has a timing issue I, I think I gotta look at that hard because it used to turn over a lot better but that's nah, just fucking righteous to say. totally has a leak there's water down here Always did. I'm gonna wait till the uh, temperature actually comes off the peg there. The tires are getting low, so if I do move it over there, I probably get the compressor out today or tomorrow. And I would say this bitch has been here a good 10 or 10 months or so. The spot. Still drive once in a while. But not since 10 months. It's a beauty as fuck day out, but uh, just getting a wee windy bike. idling as soon as you put it in gear that obviously uh, but right now we're on the high efficiency level oh 
Glenn and I were just talking about this the other day. He bought uh, this on CD. This I just bought to uh, uh, five bucks. Anyway, yeah, I just bought this to have it in the car. But this uh, was one of the first CD I ever bought with my own uh, like actual work money. This and a half a tank of gas in the '62 Thunderbird. fantastic album. Oh, she's up big bit. I really don't know what to do with the old girl. She probably should go to a new home. put some miles on it. Um, for a while it was my backup car going into town. When I wanted to save the ready a little bit, I would uh, take this thing. It wasn't gangsta leaning so bad, like the rear shocks are just fucking whack. And in fact, I got way too many videos about breaking the fuck out of the shock mount on the uh, passenger side. But it turns out the driver's side one is <laughs> is way uh, way down compared to the, uh, the one that I, I just put it back on the wheels fucking in. I could not find anywhere that would sell me a set of fucking springs. I can't believe that shit. It really, I would have thought, you know, whatever the distance between the eye holes is and how much uh, flex you want would be like a relatively standard thing, but supposedly not. sound coming over the dash. So even with kicking it down, we're still at uh, 20 inches. Like I say, it'll uh, it'll modify itself when I go into gear, but I think we're just about ready to go into gear. We're at the uh, lower end of the scale there, but it's definitely come off. If I knew what was good for me, I'd take this up to the uh, property that mom's having uh, developed for a little granny suite thing and uh, do some fucking serious donuts up there, but uh, I know we'll get, we'll get stuck so hard it's stupid. I'm feeling relatively good. Let's see what happens. If I can only drop down to 18. Struggling though. Let's go up to the top here a little bit. See what it Okay, well that's probably it.
roadside latch was stuck in. Yeah. All right. I did go out somewhere in the rabbits. Rabbits. I do gotta put some air in the tires and such, so I'll leave it out here and on a windy today I'll do it tomorrow. Who knows? <laughs> I forget what I was even talking about before I went up there. So, um, take care, have fun, stay dirty, and I'll talk to you next time. <laughs>